Nice jacket, by the way. Oh, thank you. My wife picked it up. Uh, okay, go as you get the shirt. Aquatine forever. Plantasm. Aquatine is back. I'm. Am I? Am I smiling? Am I excited? I don't know. I'm excited. I am excited. You know, this has I'm, been. I'm thrilled. Like, how long is this? Over 20 years. I was still seven, seven years. But yeah, yeah. Over the show's been on for over 20 years. It's insane. I know. That's unbelievable. I hate to make anyone feel old, but I was in college when it started. And I was uh, 12. I was very young. Very good. There's like this whole. We had a nickel for every time somebody said, "I grew up on your show." I I'm not gonna say it. And now it's like there's this whole new fan base that are like, oh, I love this and I love that. And I'm like, I'm old now. Leave me alone. Sweet. I don't know if there anybody new. Parents are weaning their young ones. Thank God there are so I'm many poor team. parents out there who let their children watch a show that Just they turn shouldn't on have TV. Been. Watch this while I go to work. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I know it's amazing how it just keeps like collecting. If it wasn't for lazy parenting, we would not still be around. Nobody There's a would number of us. people that just, well, it's a cartoon, who cares? Just let them watch it, yeah, not it. knowing there's like, you know, disgusting things that a child should not watch. But well, we're not going to complain about it because now we're profiting from it. Isn't it's good that parenting. right? Good parenting. Yeah. yeah. Good Keep parenting, parenting. Bad, bad parenting. Keep it up. Good, bad parenting. All right. That kept us alive all these years. Making enough with impressionable youth that now we can make a second move. That's right. The people are loving the, the aqua dunk. That's right. Yeah, people people dug those. We we loved making those things. Yeah. That was fun. It was like a power punch. You know, three minutes of just. Yeah. Well, when it when it's shorter form to the short form. Right. Right. Um, this is long form. Yes. Yes. Now you got a brand new movie. So, yes. what what is the plan, Tasm? Aqua Team Forever Plantasm uh, is the title of the movie, uh, but I can't. Uh, I mean, let me think about what I could say spoiler-wise uh, with regards to Plantasm. Uh, I can tell you that we were told not to tell you. <laughs> yeah, because you, you guys know I can't keep a secret after all this time. I know, and if it leaks out, it, see, it doesn't come out until November, and it's not November yet, so... Uh, not with a microphone, not with a camera. I don't trust it. I don't trust there, it. There's a microphone in my pocket. <laughs> the Plantasm. Plantasm is probably the greatest single movie event of all time. Why with the wind? Garbage. Uh, first Jurassic Park, mediocre mm. best in comparison to what's about to come. Star Wars thing, Peanuts. Everything you know about, yeah. <laughs> Slapdash is what Star Wars is compared <laughs> to that. All right. Do you remember when um, Amazon was supposed to put headquarters up here, didn't get a tax break? Mm -hmm. Well, it was sort of inspired by that. Okay. A little bit. Uh, there is sort of an... I mean, it's not even thinly veiled uh, Amazon type of yeah. reference. I, I, the company I, is called Amazon. Uh, it's sort of a satire of Silicon Valley, and uh, um, I don't want to tell you what Plantasm is, though. I, I, I can't, and you can't make me. But I will just say, Plant. I saw the Amazing part, and I kind of got that from the yes uh, synopsis. Right. And the only thing I could think of is, is there a certain doctor involved in that? A shape-shifting doctor? Longberger. Yes. Cause no. Because it's, it's a, a no, phallic like ship. pretty much burned that to the ground in that one episode. I mean, it would only make sense because, you know, ama Amazon. Right, right. Phallic, phallic ship. Uh, I, I, I keep freaking out at this tree. Do you remember, do you remember the party rooms in McDonald's, Dana? Oh, yeah. With the creepy tree. McDonald Land. Oh, yeah. for the kitties? The, the creepy tree. Well, they were all creepy. I mean, that. talking about if you saw that, the character of Big Mac, the cop, who was a Big Mac head with the old-time police cap. I mean, it, these were nightmare-inducing. The McDonald Land Is that Mayor character. McCheese? Or Mayor the, McCheese. Mayor McCheese. The cop was named Big Mac. Uh -huh. There was the Hamburglar, who's still around. Ronald McDonald, of course. Those weird little fry guys, but they came kind of later. And those weird creepy McNuggets. Yeah. And then the Big Mac, they had the playground with the giant metal. Yeah. And they started selling it was like coffee. A cage you know, in they his head. went off of they yeah. went off of the kitty stuff. And so Ronald has been put out yeah. in the fashion. Right. And now they got the adult Happy Meals. What? They got the adult Happy Meals now. You haven't heard? 
Yeah. Like, don't have some creepy ones. toys, yeah. like a birdie with four eyes comes with it, or some crazy stuff. I heard stuff about like that. that. Yeah. Now, what's word on the street about it? Also, these days, Chuck. <laughs> you're at, you're. You're asking me. Well, that's that's why I, I tried. I've, I've tried the, the different motifs. I figured, you know, my wife approved this one. But Adult Swim, it's both. Thank you. Uh, it's been brick and Morty is a thing, apparently. But now, but now it's all right. It's it's no Aqua Teen. But there's a, there's a new Aqua Teen. That's very true. Come November. We got police cars, we got this guy, I don't know who he is. Yeah, I was trying to figure that one out. It's in the police car. Frylock's got braces and glasses. So, I don't know how they mean guy. Uh, he was in the trailer. Oh, yeah, he is, yeah. Hmm. That's pretty scary stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's scary. Speaking of scary, what do you think of the new Hellraiser? Yeah, the trailer looks really good. You know, I worked on the third one. So, right. Um, I'm excited to see what they do with this thing. Yeah. I was a massive fan. That's how I got on that movie. Like I used to, well, for a while I drove around the country trying to get on the sequels of the horror movies that I loved. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I can't wait. I can't wait for that. It, it looks really good, and it, and it has uh, Doug Bradley posted. He's like, I love this. So I hung out, I make up a long, a lot with him while he was getting because I was first AD on second unit, which was all special effects. So, oh, wow! So I got to know him, and uh, a lot of those guys are great. So I have an original. Lament box at my house. Holy crap. Yes. That is awesome. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I would Even that. I think it's awesome. I'm like, God, I can't believe I have this. Thing. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, Plantas. <laughs> I know. A lot of, well, a couple of people were asking because we knew about Death Fighter when the first movie came out. Is this kind of a what became of Death Fighter? Or? You know, we touted Death Fighter a lot at a lot of cons and panels and interviews and we really wanted to make the second one but no death fighter is still in the works and yeah. it's well i'm not allowed to say this but it's a prequel to this so even though i said oh. it, but yes death fighter is, I, I won't tell anyone don't tell anybody no. okay i'm glad we're not filming this yeah it is i just want to know the creepy tree that that's that's part of that movie or that's part of plant so. i think it's part of this part of the movie yeah. So maybe that's the asm part. I think so. I think it, well, that's, that's the, the, the is the first part of the word. So yeah. maybe it's just in the first part of the movie. <laughs> what do you think? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. America, that's good for patriots. I can see it forever, baby. Yeah. That's good for international sales. Probably. But I think no. when it's in Australia, we'll put the Australian flag. UK, British, yeah. you know, we'll do that. Great marketing plan. Yeah, it will, Make it we'll universal. mix it up. Hmm. But I will say that it's a tight story, and uh, a lot of it is about how what the Aqua Teens have done since they dip, since they've parted ways, and how they've evolved and how they've changed, and how they are apart from each other. And sometimes, sometimes the sum, as we know, is greater than the parts. Gotcha. Uh, uh, so um, that's a big part of the movie. It's got a lot of heart in a weird sort of way. We actually uh, got sucked into that whole uh, Hollywood uh, cliche of... You have to compete with Bob's there's Burgers. Some, there's some emotion to it. Yeah, so we're very proud of it. And very good. Also, it's 70 minutes. You hate it. Um, my, you hate it, you get out early. My big question... Well, I have the, the 4K pre-ordered. What is the... What is, is there a benefit to 4K? I think we're the only... Out of the three movies, we're the only one that is 4K. Really? Yeah, seriously. So Venture's not so going to be in 4K? I don't think Venture is, I don't think Metal is, but uh, we are. Uh, That's awesome. I think we held car washes to afford it. <laughs> it looks dynamite. I will say Craig Harton, our animation director at Bento Box Atlanta, did an unbelievable job. It is far and far away the best animated thing that we've done. Like there's real animation. Like the character's lips move, except in one scene, which I noticed <laughs> two days ago, and I told Craig, and it's too late. It's too late to there's change it. You'll see there's one scene where a sentence is said and the character's lips do not move. But aside from that, it's good. Occupational hazard. John, how much would you give to have one of these posters? Who are you? <laughs> I wish I wish I had it on my wall, and then my wife would go, "Why did you bring this home?" Oh, she'll love it. 
Then you'd, make, sure then you two sure. would make passionate love under the poster. <laughs> Taking turns. <laughs> so you could look up and see the poster. Did you have uh, any more actual questions? Um, is the show still based in Jersey? Absolutely. Okay. Thank God. Yes, right. I mean, of course. We, we just... It's just funny to us to use the same backgrounds and say it was they moved to Seattle. Jersey, the landscape of Jersey has changed a little bit since well, yeah. we last saw it. Well, yeah, it does that. Carl's neighborhood is actually people are uh, um, building lofts in his neighborhood and bulldozing stuff. And Carl is they, is ecstatic about it. They they do that though. That's that's what I did. I moved out to Staten Island for three years. I come back. It's all buildings. I was telling him earlier. Yeah, he's checking. They're checking. Uh, um, Carl's checking Zillow like four times a day. He's excited, uh, but it's all tied in. It's all tied into the show. You know why I picked New Jersey? It's because because uh, of New Jersey from Buckaroo Banzai, which is one of my favorite places. With that being said, two questions that I want to pose to you, and maybe Carl: Is it por pork roll or is it Taylor ham? That's that's a big Jersey thing. Oh, uh, no, no, no. Uh, bologna. But cheese loaf. I, I, I don't pay for the name brand. I'm not going to pay. I'm going to just because you, you, you slap Oscar Mayo on something or Taylor. Whatever, you know. I'd rather. I pay for the quality, but I'm not going to pay for any advertising budget. All right. Pork roll or is it Taylor ham? And don't say Taylor ham. Okay, it's pork roll. Yeah. I don't even know what the means. What that means? It's it's a big Jersey. I'm a Jersey guy, it so is. it's a big yeah, Jersey. Jersey right now. Yeah. I just picked it because, you know, because well, there's clearly castles like Doctor Weirds in New Jersey. Yeah. And it makes sense that we would set it there because of castles. Yeah, I don't visit the rich areas too often, but I know there's a castle in Lindhurst, but that's where the knights. Yeah. Uh, Doctor Weird Castle. That's yeah. A different part of Jersey. Yeah. That may be it's not in here. And the, the second question, what would be the New Jersey State Anthem? Because I found out there is no state anthem. There is no state anthem. No. So they don't make children sing Living on a Prayer before class? They should. They should. I hear it on the radio. I'm like, this is the state anthem. Yeah, well, you know, but the... The numb nuts in uh, the ca the capital won't do anything about it. Won't make it legal. Won't put it on a legal tender. It's a damn shame. So that's gonna be yeah. It's an uphill battle because you know uh, our elected officials they don't they're not working for the common man and uh, doing uh, putting Bon Jovi on uh, one dollar bills. <laughs> Too much that's money. A, that's a federal issue. Bon Jovi should put his own face on the dollar bill at this point. Tax and spend Democrats. <laughs> Thanks so much. You Thanks can catch you can catch Aqua Teen Forever, Plantasm. November eighth. November eighth. Digital 4K Blu-ray. Pre-order it now. Yes. Oh yeah, the shoes, not bombs. That's right. And there's a whole baffler meal set out now. Twenty discs. Everything. Every, all the every episode, episode, all the extras the scenes, from everything, stuff. including all the seasons oh, yeah. they never released on, uh, you know, all the, the other names. The of aqua -teen yeah. Cornucopia. Yeah. What's the I like that. in aqua -teen? Very good. Of course. Well, well, aqua of course. Yeah. Well said. The big steaming pile of aqua -teen of stuff. Aqua. By the movie. would make a lot of sense, but uh, sadly, uh, C. Martin Croker passed away, the voice of Dr. Weird and Steve, so he he's not, Dr. Weird is not in the movie, but... Uh, I meant Wongberger, though. Oh. Yes, rest in peace, Clay. Oh.